Hello Columbia and welcome to City View where we bring you an inside view of the City of Columbia. I'm your host, Alicia Utsi. In our top story for City View, we take you to Page Ellington Park where the City of Columbia held the National Night Out kickoff. This year's City of Columbia National Night Out kickoff event was truly a success. After missing last year's event due to the pandemic, both citizens and city staff were very excited about this event in order to re-engage Columbia. The event was attended by city leaders as well as community leaders. Our city leaders proclaimed the day in honor of National Night Out and a proclamation was given to both Police Chief William Skip Holbrook and our Fire Chief Arbor D. Jenkins. In addition, there were prizes, games, music, food, and lots and lots of fun. This event was a perfect intro and segue prior to National Night Out, which was celebrated in various neighborhoods throughout our community on Tuesday, August 3rd. What it looks like National Night Out 2021 was a hit in many of our City of Columbia neighborhoods. Next, we take you to the Charles R. Drew Wellness Center where the City of Columbia held a community job fair. The community job fair featured many local hiring employers and job seekers and the chance to participate in many career building workshops throughout the event. This is an opportunity for residents in our community to come out and see available jobs, meet one-on-one -on -one with potential employers, also go through workshops such as interview skills, resume building, and dressing for success, and then they can actually apply for jobs on site. We've got the SC Works van out here where people can meet with a career coach, apply for jobs, um, and really just get connected with uh, resources to help them get gainfully employed. Charles R. Drew Wellness Center was not only the site for a community job fair, but also for our community vaccine clinics. The City of Columbia has been partnering with many local health care providers to provide free vaccine clinics for citizens in our community. As coronavirus cases rise in the Midlands, our city leaders are urging everyone to please get vaccinated for your protection and the protection of your family and friends. Not only was the month of July a month where you can receive free vaccines, but also as we enter into the month of August, free vaccine clinics will be held in each one of our four city council districts. Please visit these vaccine clinics and receive a free vaccine for yourself and for family members. For more details, visit columbiasc.gov and also resilient.columbiasc.gov. Now we transition from keeping our community safe to keeping our City of Columbia staff safe. The City of Columbia recently received two South Carolina OSHA Safety Awards for outstanding safety performance. To be able to reduce your recordable incident rate by 20% from the previous year, that says a lot. Now today we're being recognized uh, with uh, the Department of Public Works and also to uh, Department of, of Public Administration. All across the board, the City of Columbia organizations reduced their incident rate by 18%. That's include the whole organizational umbrella for the City of Columbia. That is tremendous. A special thanks to all of our City of Columbia employees for your efforts in keeping our workplaces safe. And speaking of our employees, Amy Moore in our Planning and Development Services Department 
recently was awarded the Historic Columbia Foundation's Preservation Leadership Award at the July 20th City Council meeting. Following a recognition of Frank B. Washington and a sharing of his bio regarding all of his accolades and contributions to the community, Mayor Steve Benjamin also greeted his family members who were present during the council meeting. In the City of Columbia's continuing efforts to encourage our citizens to become vaccinated, an educational effort has been wrapped around one of our garbage trucks as well as one of our recycling trucks. The educational message is regarding It's Your Shot Columbia, which is our vaccine education message. These trucks will travel throughout the community as they pick up recycling and garbage in various neighborhoods. As citizens see these trucks in neighborhoods and on major thoroughfares, we hope that this message will resonate and be a reminder to all that it is so important to become vaccinated against COVID-19. Well, that wraps up this edition of City View. Thank you for watching and for staying engaged in our city. To watch more of what's going on in the City of Columbia, tune in to City TV on Spectrum Channel 1301, or you can watch our YouTube channel. You can also catch us on Roku and Amazon Fire TV. Please continue to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and also visit our website at columbiasc.gov for more information. Thanks again, and remember, we are Columbia.